Mefianyame sent a very good delivery come for the Wusu and it's a penalty to the Ghanaians for a challenge on Comfort Owusu. And look at that, how that decision is well flourish. Sebastian, penalty for the Ghanaians. And Comfort Yeboa, the dead ball specialist of the Ghanaians, who plays for. She wasn't the one who takes it. Stella Nyamiche and scores. Another dead ball specialist. Stella Nyamiche puts the Ghanaians in the lead from the spot kick. But the referee has ordered for a retake after a protest from the Ghanaians. Referee indicated that there was a form of movement and invasion into the 18 yard box, and as such, a retake should be done. So, Ibechi has the second opportunity to save, but once again, the same spot, Stella Nyamiche does it in a tantalizing manner for the Ghanaians, and that takes her tally to four goals. The young player, less than 18 years, is a coach, a calf licensed D coach, Stella Nyamiche on target, a captain that has indeed led by example from that dead ball situation. And that same spot, Igbechi couldn't save that. Another to ensure that the scoreline remains the same. 40 minutes. The dead ball specialist and the captain of the Ghanaians, Stella Nyamiche, gets the first goal for her team. Afolabi Taiwo for Nigeria. And Nigeria get the chance to equalize, and they do. 1-1 one, one is the score line. Flourish. Sebastian would be the happiest of all the Nigerian players. She was the one that gave away the penalty and she has been the one that has called for her team. Right on the stroke of ending the game. What a dramatic end it has turned out to be. Taiwo Afolabi started this attack and build up. Managed to find Amina Bello who came up with that dip and Afi Amenyaku for the first time missed that ball and this is what flourish Sebastian who is already on three goals in this tournament wouldn't miss for anything what an end to this game Ghana won Nigeria won come for the Abua against Igbechi Adlin of Nigeria and comfort has to shoulder this responsibility for the Ghanaians she does and that's where she always scores top corner before she celebrates and she's telling her i told you you can't save my penalty that was a penalty which comfort yabwa took for the Ghanaians. chidima oguchi chidima against afi amenyaku Ghania is already leading. Chidima, Afi saves. Chidima fails to score. And the fans of the Ghanaian celebrate. Afi Amanyaku had a very perfect direction of the ball. Georgina Aisha of Ghana, who plays for Pelopia Ladies, is behind. Coming up against Adlin, and Adlin saves. Georgina fails to score two. And Adlin Igbechi tells her teammate to calm down. Flourish against Afi Emanyaku. And Afi makes a double save. Afi with a second consecutive save for. The Ghanaians flourish of Bayelsa Queens 
fails to score. She has the equalizer at the dying embers of the game, but she captain her team to such a major tournament. She has the responsibility. She does in a very fashionable manner. Stella Nyamiche scores for Ghana. So it's Ghana 2, Nigeria 0 for the number of kicks taken. And this is where but she couldn't even get the direction. Ghana have scored 2, Nigeria none. And if Esther doesn't score, that means Afi has made three crucial saves for Ghana. All the three penalties, Esther failed. And Afi has become the heroine of the Ghanaian team. She started with this exploit in the early minutes of the game. And she has continued through to the extra time, through the penalties for her team. Helen of Siam Socrates against Ingwechi Adlin of Delta Queens. Helen fails to score. And Adlin is beckoning to her teammates that I have made two crucial saves. What are you doing to help me as well? Helen Alomenu missing this glorious chance to help Ghana for them to be crowned the champions of this maiden edition of such a prestigious tournament. Messi, if she misses this, would be doomed for the Falconets of Nigeria. Messi against Afi Abenyaku. She scores. And that is the first penalty that has been scored by the Nigerians. Afi couldn't find a direction. And that means the final kick. If Ghana scores this, it would mean they would win this tournament. Ikbechi Adeline against Marian Ponsan, and she scores. Ghana are the inaugural champions of the Wafu Under 20 U Girls Cup, the host and win mission and the campaign that they had before the commencement of this tournament is successful. Mary and Ponsan with the last kick for the Ghanaians. She is the second top scorer of Ghana's league that recently ended. She took a huge breather before this lovely penalty kick to help the Ghanaians win this maiden tournament. Huge, huge congratulations to the Ghanaian team and commiserations to the Nigerian team. This is what football is all about. But the Nigerians in the long run will take solace in the fact that they lost gallantly, having been able to come to this competition and only concede in the grand finale, this is a huge win for them. They lost, but the consolation will be that they lost gallantly. But for the Ghanaians, the host and win mission is accomplished. Coach Yusif Bazigi and his technical team would forever remember this day. And so would every fan who watch across the globe this wonderful tournament which was aired live on max tv can get to see your vibax media equally be happy